New at 6, we're getting an inside look at the classroom of the future. Students are now able to learn from the human body without using an actual cadaver. Anchor Philip Townsend has the story. We're going to have the cecum, we're going to get the ascending colon, we have the transverse colon. Which is Early on, when you're studying to get into the medical field, that usually involves something that's pretty intimidating. I was pretty concerned about the cadaver thing. I was scared. What is the very first part of the gastrointestinal tract? But here at ECPI University's College of Health Science. Descending colon, fantastic. New technology is and helping students explore okay. the human body. Like cut there. Anywhere, anytime, without that initial shock. Okay. Gives us the 3D fine. models with, without all the mess. And it's very hands-on. This is the anatomage table. So we have some sphincters that we're going to go through. You can visualize anatomy exactly as you would with a fresh cadaver, but this is still a real person, just digitized. Instructor Kirsten Mahan can do quizzes on the table, dissect the body freely. Certain tools even allow you to go down to the tissue and cellular level. And after all that, you can touch a button to bring the cadaver back to where it was originally and, and go on to something else. It's been huge for student Anna Wilson. She's studying to become a registered nurse. It's nice being able to click on a tiny little nerve and know what it is. There it is, right near your temples. OK, they don't want to leave the lab. <laughs> and the numbers back that up. In the year that the school has been using the table, pass rates in one of their most difficult courses, anatomy and physiology, have increased by around 25 percent. For 13 News Now, I'm Philip Townsend.